small stomach. But the right kind of snacking can help keep them fueled throughout the day and prevent them from overeating at mealtime. I'm Melissa Hallis Liang, registered dietitian with superkidsnutrition.com. And today I'm gonna to talk about healthy snacking. And we're gonna look at making mini meals because kids have mini stomachs. Come on guys. Who's ready to make some yummy snacks? All right. Well, we're gonna start out by making some olive, reduced fat cheese, and pepper kebabs. First, we're gonna take a little pepper and try to cut it. Oh, look at that. Great job, Nicholas. Okay, then we're gonna take this yummy cheese and put that on. I'm using Cabot reduced fat and low fat cheese because it has the same taste and flavor as a higher fat cheese, plus it's the choice that kids like. Go ahead, now you're gonna do an olive. Wow, you can even, I love it. Cabot low fat cheese is also a good source of protein and calcium. And kids really need protein at this age for growth and development. Let me see those muscles. <laughs> oh, wow. Now who likes pasta? I do. So now we're gonna make pasta kebabs. And mini snacks can add up to one great meal when you're scrambling at six o'clock for dinner. Another snack you can make is apple and cheese kebabs. Apples are a wonderful source of fiber. Anytime you're choosing a reduced fat or low fat cheese, try to pair it with a fruit, vegetable, or whole grain. Cheese will provide you with the protein to hold you over to that next meal. And including those fruits and veggies will help meet your fruit and vegetable quota for the day. <laughs> This is one easy and healthy snack that kids really like, and how does that taste? <laughs> Yummy! I love cheese. Choosing healthy snacks from an early age can help create a lifetime of healthy eating habits. Be sure to visit superkidsnutrition.com for more healthy meal snack time tips.